is the number one money maker in the wrestling. He gets the people to the arena. He sells the tickets, sells the t-shirts, sells the product. The reason why I am as important to the myth of Chad Deity as Chad Deity himself is fact number five. Chad Deity is a terrible wrestler. <laughs> Mace is the guy that makes Chad Deity look good. He knows the drill, he knows the skill set, and he's the one who therefore knows how to lose perfectly. As we move on, we find out what the point of the story is, and it's this wonderful discovery of this young kid named VP, who, in Mace's mind, could change the industry. VP is a young Indian-American Brooklynite. He's very smooth, very articulate, good with the ladies. He's probably the face of multiculturalism in America today. Here comes the next new guy down the pipe, and we're going to make millions off of him. This could work, mate. Is this all that's doing? Yeah. We're trying to find ways to maximize safety. The play requires certain dangerous moves, super kicks, power bombs, camel clutches, which isn't that dangerous, but it sounds cool. You're watching wrestling, but you're really understanding the world of an artist and where you decide that your heart lies. Is it in the creative side or is it in the cash side? Chad Deity's elaborate entrance defeats demons, <laughs> and we feel like our demons deserve that defeat. <laughs> and we feel, more importantly, that we can be the ones to defeat the 